Hello water signs and welcome back to my channel. This is Dee and I hope you are doing well. To my current and new subscribers, thank you for your support. It is greatly appreciated. Water signs, this is a general reading for you from the Romance Angels Oracle card deck, which may or may not resonate with you. If it does, great. If it doesn't, just let it pass. In other words, take what resonates with you and leave the rest. So let's get to your message. God Most High, Angel Spirit Guns, Beings of Love and Light, the Holy Spirit. What is the message for Cancer for their greatest and highest good? From the Romance Angels Oracle card deck. Cancer, you have free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. So if you've allowed yourself to be completely consumed with making sure that your partner is happy in your relationship and have lost yourself, even neglected yourself, you're being encouraged to take the time to take back control of your life. Like take some time to reset is what I'm getting. Like regroup step back look at the situation see how this all happened that you lost yourself and take the proactive action to free yourself to make sure that there is balance in the relationship it shouldn't be imbalance where you're giving so much to the relationship and losing who you are losing yourself you should still have the ability to remain your authentic self, getting what you need in the relationship as well as giving to your partner. So we see that there's a beautiful unicorn that's in this uh, fence, right? That could simply free itself. There doesn't appear to be um, an, an apparent gate but as a unicorn it could just simply jump over the gate and just go out enjoy the flowers enjoy the trees enjoy whatever is outside of the the gate but you know it's just sitting there being content waiting for someone else to come along to open the gate to let them out and and look the unicorn is absolutely gorgeous it's beautiful you're gorgeous you're beautiful you're handsome you're amazing but you have lost yourself a little and now you're being encouraged to take back control of your life don't just sit back and be content and allow things just to go as normal or what appears to be normal, but take a proactive action to create that harmony and balance in your relationship by allowing there to be this balance of you giving and receiving what you deserve as well as your partner. So it's time to take back control of your life, Cancer. Free yourself you can do it you have the inner strength to do it you can reset you can reset i hope this has been helpful god most high and do spirit guys peace and love and light the holy spirit what is the message for scorpio from the romance angels oracle card deck as for their goodness and highest good okay let's see what you have scorpio You have codependency. Addictions are affecting your romantic life. So it could be addictions on many level, many levels. Um, I can't even name one, con one um, addiction because there are so many addictions that we can all engage in that creates codependency. So you know what, what the card is referring to. 
and I feel like you're being strongly encouraged to um, address the issue so that your relationship can become more cohesive again because the addiction is causing you to be dependent upon it. It could be a number of things. I don't feel like it's necessary to name any specific addiction, but you know what's coming up for you and that's what you're being encouraged to address. So you may have been like really in deep thought about it, what to do, what action to take, and you may be considering, um, you know, what is my next step? You know, if you look closely, the woman here, she's in deep thought. She's in deep thought about what's her next step to address this. So you yourself may have been recently in deep thought about what you should do to address it. You know that it exists. It's happening. You realize it. You just haven't taken any proactive action. And your partner is standing by your side, is supportive of you, but there still is a need to address the addiction because it is taking a toll on your romantic life. Once again, it's causing you to be codependent. So however that looks, Scorpio, whatever it looks like for you, know that there is hope for your relationship to be revitalized, to receive or to have that um, harmony reestablished, but it takes you addressing the addiction that's affecting your romantic life. It takes you to own it, be honest, be authentic. No blame, no blaming anyone else. Take responsibility for yourself and for your own actions and how this addiction has affected your romantic life. It can be repaired because that's what I'm getting. I'm getting the relationship can be repaired, but it takes you addressing the addiction. So I send love your way, Scorpio. And I would encourage you to be proactive in addressing the addiction so that you can have harmony again in your romantic relationship. So I hope this has been helpful, helpful, Scorpio. Almost high angel spirit guides. Oh, Pisces, your card jumped out on the floor. Is there anything else for Pisces? That's for their greatest and highest good from the romance angels oracle card deck. All right. Let me get your card off the floor, Pisces. Whoa. <laughs> Pisces, your card that jumped out of the deck is trust. Trust that this situation is calling. This situation is calling for you to have faith. Have faith in the process. Have faith that everything is going to work out for you and your partner. Trust. Trust the process. And trust that everything is unfolding naturally as it should. So let me get your other message as well, Pisces. You have getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, you bond, your bond deepens, excuse me. So the more you and your partner are open and vulnerable and talking about your innermost um, selves, things that you would not normally share, it's only going to help your bonds, your bond deepen. So you're being encouraged to get to know your partner and vice versa. 
And regardless of how long you've been together, you can never know a person completely. Trust me. You could never know a person completely. You, you may think you do, but you don't. So you're being encouraged to really get to know each other. Again, it doesn't matter how long you have been with your partner. This is key at this time. Getting to know each other is important. So again, Pisces, as you reveal your innermost selves to each other, you and your partner, vice versa, your bond deepens. It's just going to make your relationship flourish. It, it's going to exceed your expectations. But it takes you being open. And so looking at the couple on the card, you can see that both the women, the woman and the man, you know, they look like they're pretty content. She's happy, laughing. You know, he has a little grin on his face. So, you know, being open with your partner, your partner is just going to really embrace it and vice versa. So it's just a matter of you just being open, authentic, vulnerable, and then expressing your innermost selves. Where can you go in your relationship but up by being open and honest with each other? Expressing your innermost selves, you know, talking about how passionate you are for each other and, you know, the things that you really love and appreciate about one another. You know, just being authentic. Even the smallest thing that you may think, oh, this is silly, but share it. Your partner may get a kick out of it. They may think it's adorable. They may think it's cute. So be open to sharing it. All right. So I hope that was helpful for you. Pisces, you have trust and getting to know each other. So trust that this situation is going to work out for the good of you and your partner because it's calling, calling you to have faith. And as you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. So again, I hope this has been helpful, Pisces. So thank you all for watching. If you are new here to my channel, please consider like, commenting, sharing, and subscribing most importantly to my channel. Also, everyone, please turn on your notification bell so that when a message is uploaded, you will receive the alert and you can go directly to the message and you won't miss out on any messages at all. So until the next time, water signs, take good care of yourselves. I will talk to you soon. Bye for now.